Hi guys, welcome back to the challenge. Um, I'm Wayne, this is my channel. If you want to subscribe, hit that button down below. Um, roll credits, and I'm going to tell you what I'm going to be doing in a second. See you in a second. Okay, so this week, what are we going to be doing? I've decided that my cabin is a editing suite, a filming suite, a child's play centre for my children to come down and play. Um, and you've seen some of the things that we do here on my channel. Um, this week, I've decided it's now going to become a cinema room. And it's all designed to be set up so that it doesn't take up any space in here and it can all be put back and you don't see anything afterwards. So yesterday I went onto Amazon and I set myself a budget of £200 to build myself a cinema. And I have some things at home already that I can use, but these are things that you should have in your house as well if you want to do this. I know it's a rather large expense, but I want to see whether it's worth the money. So I went onto Amazon yesterday and I bought myself a projector and a screen and I'll flash that up now so you can see how much it's come to. So yes, it was about £192 and it was on sale on Amazon. So I managed to get the projector and a screen for a quite a cheap price. Now, I know that Amazon have just delivered it because they've just sent me this photo and it's up on my front doorstep waiting for me now. So, I'm going to go upstairs and it is rather cold out. My, my cabin is insulated. Um, so I'm just going to put my hat on, I'm going to go up there, get it, bring it down here, open it and then you're going to get to see me set it up in a time lapse after I've opened it for you guys. So let's get going. Okay, back in a second. Oh god, it's actually really cold out there. So. This is what you saw just then. This is what Amazon have just dropped off to me. This is less than 24 hours ago. You can sort of see why the high street is going under. I do support local shops, but on this case, I went to Curry's and a similar unit to what I just wanted to buy was about 400 pounds <laughs> without anything, without any extra. So um, what did I buy? I brought, let's have a quick look. I want to get through this a bit quick because I've got to edit in a time lapse of um, me setting all this up quick. And I'm pretty new to the home cinema thing, so I'm gonna try and do my best job. Um, so, 200 pounds for a home cinema. Can we do it? I don't know. So, that's a screen for a cinema. Uh, it's a black, it's a black bat screen. It comes with rope. It feels soft. It feels like a material. Um, oh, this looks interesting. So this looks like it's the screen. Black. No, it's white on the inside. There we go. It's white on the inside. So I have a screen. Okay. So first things first. I have a screen to project everything onto. That's a good start. So oh, this is the actual. I did my research on this and I can stream uh, YouTube and you're going to get to see Emma and John at the end of this. They did a vlog um, a couple of weeks back and I asked their permission to say do they mind if I copied their vlog which I don't do very often but I started watching this vlog that they did and it was so so amazing and I was engrossed one of the best most engrossing vlogs I've seen on Emma and John so go check out their channel. Um, it was all about YouTubing and why they do and their YouTubing likes and dislikes and, and stuff like that. So I'm going to do that. However, I'm going to show you once I set all this up, Emma and John on the big screen, because I think they deserve it. Um, John's an ex-fireman and they're such a lovely couple and they do watch my vlogs and they do comment. So it's sort of a shout out. So this is the Yeber projector. Oh, hello. It's quite scary, isn't it? 
So all this is for under two hundred pounds. Um, so there we go. That's the projector in there. Um, I'm sure there's other bits and bobs in there. This is quite scary. I've never done this before. So. I'm actually doing all this in the next couple of hours. I'm not actually, when you actually watch this vlog, all this is going to be done in sort of like a time lapse. You're going to see me set it up um, and do all sorts of bits and bobs. So in the time lapse, I might even put some funky music in there. I don't know. So uh, I'm assuming that's supplementaries. I think it's supplementaries. Uh, Yes, I've got USB cables, VGA for the computer, a remote control, phono leads, power leads, and clips. Um, so I'll figure that out as I go along. Um, this should be able to project up to a 100 inch screen. And if I can go back even further, I think it will go up to even bigger than that, providing I don't know how, what the screen, how big the screen is going to go. I'm quite excited to set all this up. So here we go. This is ooh, well wrapped. <laughs> this is this is well wrapped. So this is my projector. So this is a Yeaver projector, and I've done lots of online research about this one, um, and it's come up with really good reviews. This is an LED projector not a bulb one and it will last for I think 70,000 hours which I think works out at you could keep this thing switched on for five years six years without switching it off and they don't get as hot uh, but I do I understand that they do generate some noise background noise but that's something I think I can live with um, I do have a little speaker which I'm going to plug into this because it has phonos on the back which I've just spotted and it looks like it's got two USBs so once again, you can plug your Apple TV into this. You should be able to plug your laptops into this. You should be able to plug your Blu-ray players into this. I already have a spare Blu-ray player, which I do not use because I just tend to use a lot of Netflix and streaming services now. So I've got a spare Blu-ray player that I don't actually use. So um, if you've got a laptop, you can use that. It comes with a VGA output or HDMI output. So. Without that being said now, I need to start hammering some clips into the walls to put the screen up. I need to configure a Blu-ray player and this together. And let's do that in a time lapse. Okay, see you in about one minute. Let's get going. So, screens up behind me, I've had to take my lighting down, which is why I've got a shadow on my face. Um, screens up, went up quite quick, really, didn't take too long to get the screen put up. Um, yes, that's easier than I thought. Um, so, I've just got the electronics to do now. I'm going to plug in the Blu-ray player and power it up. However, I've come across a snag. Um, this projector will not work unless it is almost a hundred percent black in the room and as this is a sunny house sunny a sunny cabin with light coming through even if i turn the windows shut the windows and put the blackout blinds down um i don't think it's going to be dark enough so i've come up with a temporary ingenious idea how to black out your room and don't laugh when it's done it will work um, I just ha I think I've heard someone doing it before so I'm going to use bin liners yes I'm going to make my own blackout blinds with bin liners on a temporary basis so that being said I'm not going to time lapse me gluing bin liners together however I'm going to put the bin liners up black out the room come back and hopefully we'll get to see some youtubers on the big screen that's quite good isn't it so here we go uh i'm gonna click my fingers and as if and like magic it should all go very black in here so okay bear with me 
and it's dark. So let's have the lights back on. Whoa, look at that. Hey. So, welcome to the Mandeville Home Cinema. So now when I watch your vlogs, Emma and John, this one's for you. Leia, come sit down over here. So, we've now set up so we, we can watch. Come over here, say hello. Hi. Hi. So we've now set up so we can watch Emma and John, Happily Ever Edwards, Flat Fam, Jen and Joe, Disney DIYer. Any more? Two Disney Broke Mice. Two Broke Mice. We can watch you guys on the big screen. You see me put it up. Now, very quickly, I'm going to show you Emma and John as, a, as you've never seen them before. So, I'm going to put this one down. Turn the I think you should turn the lights off, young lady. Okay. Just turn me on. Go for it. Whoa, look at this. It's an actual cinema. Do you want to stand in front so they can see yeah, actually how big it is? Stand in front so you can see, they can see how big the screen is. I am very small She's very small. It's making me look really small. Okay, no. let's watch some uh, let's watch some Emma and John. Oh, 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 oh. Merry Christmas! Morning. Hello, it's Christmas Eve. It is, yes. We thought we would vlog today and tomorrow. I think we vlogged um Christmas Day last year. It is. But obviously Christmas is a little bit different this year, so we wanted to share it with you guys again and also kind of document. Okay, should we uh, pause Absolutely. that? Yeah, go put the light back on. Today. Um I've got to put a gazebo back up because it got blown down last night. Um at the moment we've got back on then. defrosting. There we go. Look at that. So I'm actually gonna stand in front so you guys can see how big the screen is. Let's put this up. So you guys can actually see how big the screen is. It's huge. It's massive. It's massive. Um, so we're going to put red runway lights down here for the kids. And the beauty is, so let me turn this round. The beauty is that when all this is finished, we can. Um, okay, come over here. The beauty is when all this is finished, it just comes off the wall and everything gets put away and it goes back into the normal office. Oh, and just in case you're wondering about the bin liners. They are temporary, and I'm going to show you. It's actually extremely bright outside, but look at this. I made my own blackout blinds, and it is very bright out. It's actually very bright outside. We made our own blackout blinds. Um, Emma and John, hope you didn't mind me using your clip. Um, on that note, they did do a really good video um, about a month ago, and I'm going to copy what they've done. Well, not copy, I'm going to do their vlog but with my answers. Um, and I'll see you guys next week. Okay. See you, bye. 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 What should we watch next on Netflix? Um, we can be heroes. We can be heroes? We can watch our next. No. Okay, we're, we're going to go over and watch some Netflix now in, in the cinema. Should we get the popcorn machine out as well? Popcorn. Popcorn machine. We're going to get the no, popcorn maybe machine out. Maybe we can vlog out. that. We can vlog it. No, we've vlogged the popcorn machine. Well, we have it, but it was a total disaster. Yeah. I think that was kind should of funny. We, should we carry on watching Emma and John? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to carry on watching Emma and John. I'll turn the lights off. We'll see you guys next week. Bye.